Hello beautiful people, my name is Kyla, if you're new to my channel, welcome, if you're returning, glad to see you again. Um, today I'm going to be talking a little bit about Clarisonic, um, specifically in this case the Mia 2 and the brush heads that you can get or can buy from Clarisonic and the ones that you can get from different brands that will fit your Clarisonic. Um, so I was actually given the Mia 2 when I was first uh, given it as a Christmas gift about three years ago. Um, just make sure when you're getting them because there's a lot of counterfeit out there that the Clarisonic is actually spaced out properly. It's not all squished together. Um, and that there is a code down on the bottom that when you sign up with Clarisonic that it makes you an account, it gives you your warranty and it, it lets you know what's going on sale and what promotions are for that brush. Um, you can also unsubscribe from the emails, not a big deal, everybody's different whether or not they want to get returned about that. Um, so when you guys first get it, mine came with this little bag because it was part of a promotion. Um, came with the cord itself. These guys are pretty cool because it actually just snaps on to the bottom. Stays on when it's laying down. Falls off when it's standing up. You can also get stand ones for these now. Um, and then it comes with a brush head. It'll come in a little box like this. Um, this is a delicate one. This is one of the few that I have. Um, I'm currently using one from Natural Pure. Sorry, Natural Premium. Um, I got these in a four pack off Amazon. I also have the acne prone skin one um, just because I rotate through them. I like the way the different brushes help with my skin. Um, so the brushes are pretty interesting. They just snap in and out, rotate and pop. Same to go in, push, rotate, and pop. So with the Mia 2, it's um, this one is a 2-in-1. The newest one is a 3-in-1 because they upped it so that you have 3 speeds rather than 2. Um, so when you turn it on, it lights up. So this is at the highest speed right now. When you put it to the lower, the light goes down. Um, when you have it finished, the light will flash. When you need to charge it, the light will flash. It will turn off on its own. When it is done, you get, I think it's 20 seconds, 20 seconds, 10 and 10. Um, when you are charging it, the light will flash by itself like it is now. And then it will stay solid when it is completely charged. Um, in which case, you just unplug it. It lasts for me for about two weeks, and that's with using it every day, sometimes twice a day, depending on whether or not I'm wearing makeup, um, which is pretty cool. So a little bit about the brush heads, because I did want to show you guys what they look like. The brush heads, because I did mention I do use some Clarisonic ones specifically, and I do use some uh, third party brands for mine. Um, so one of the ones I like is the Delicates brush heads for fragile and dry skin. Um, I use this one a lot more in the winter time um, and I rotate that with one of my deep pore ones just because my skin gets really dry in the winter. Um, this guy when I originally bought him was $30. Um, I did check a little bit earlier. They are still $30 um, for the deep core one for the delicate, for the sensitive, um, they have a men's one so that again they can get in through their beard, that one's $30. Um, and then you have what they call the radiance ones, those are all the Clarisonics. Um, they can range anywhere from $30 to $40, um, unless you're getting one of the specialty ones where it's like a foundation brush or it's a face massager, in which case it can go anywhere from $50 to $79, depending on which one you're looking at. Um, but when you first get your Clarisonic, when you sign it up, uh, you will get a 10% off, which I recommend in using if you're going to stock up on a few brushes, because you can go through anywhere between four to five brushes in a year. Um, again, just because 
if you wear makeup, your brush is going to go a little bit faster than if you don't. Um, if you have a really thick stubble, your brush is going to get worn out a lot faster than if you're a clean shaver. Just the little things that naturally impede what we're using. Um, they just get thrown out like regular. Unfortunately, they aren't recyclable. Um, but for doing it once every four months, it's not too bad on the environment as far as I'm aware because the materials they use are pretty environmentally friendly. Um, anywho, um, I did say I would talk about some of the third-party brushes. So these were the ones that I originally found that I really liked, which is the Nutra Creme. Um, unfortunately, at the moment while I'm making this video, they are unavailable in stock because their site is down. They're having a problem with it. Um, but the one pack I paid $25 for, the other pack I paid $28 for simply because there is a lot more brushes in the one, like little brush pieces in the one than there is the other. Um, so it costs a little bit different for that. Um, if you're going to get one of the ones where it's for the deep pore, for the acne, for the sensitive, for the um, radiance, you're going to look at a little bit more money for the fact that the brushes are a little bit different. Um, so the more brush hairs that they have in the brush, the more expensive it is going to be. Um, there's a TB, TPLB brand that currently has four packs on for $12.99. Um, there's also LSQ Tonics, which have 14, four packs again for $14.99. Um, so they're pretty good at price-wise if you're going to look through third parties, and I will link a few down in the description below for you guys. Um, as well as I will put a link to the Parasonic website for you to do a personalized test. Um, and for the Mia 2, uh, for some people, if you're looking at the Mia 2, you might want to look at um, Sephora or Shoppers Drug Mart, um, any second parties that sell the actual Clarisonics, because you can sometimes get them on sale, because originally the Clarisonic is $229. Um, if you get the value pack or the gift pack from Sephora, you're looking about $300 simply because you're going to get samples and stuff with it. Um, and to be honest, some of the samples are pretty good. Some might not suit you. It all depends on the person you're getting it for. Um, when my parents bought mine, they bought me a gift pack, so it was actually $300 from Sephora. And I used a few of the samples. Um, I had a skin serum I really liked that I got a sample for. The uh, cream cleanser I was not a fan of. It dried my skin out, but you try a few things, you find a few things. It all depends on you. Um, anywho, I'm pretty sure that's it. If you guys have any questions about the Clarisonic and the way that the brush moves or if the way the... Um, skin might feel afterwards or cleaning it, maintaining it, let me know down in the comments below. Hopefully you guys will like and subscribe to my channel and there will be more videos to come. If you guys have anything you'd like me to talk about, by all means, let me know down in the comments or message me either way. You can find me on social media and um, WordPress at the same name, Beautiful Artistic Muse. And I hope you guys have a beautiful day.